Hey everyone, I'm Steve from GamersNexus.net and this is just a quick note about how to resolve some of the mouse smoothing and acceleration experienced in Call of Duty Black Ops 3, which just released. And you may have noticed this if you're already playing the game, but basically, and this is especially noticeable in the menu systems, there is a slight amount of lag or spurious motion or undesirable input from the mouse when using certain settings in the game. So the main thing to look at first of all is to just go to the controls menu because there is actually a checkbox that very simply says frame smoothing. So you just go disable that first thing first and then go to mouse acceleration and mouse filtering. Make sure those are zero if you are sort of of the purebred Counter-Strike style input player where you want almost no modification or zero modification of your input. And then the biggest thing to note with Black Ops 3 is that to a greater degree than some other games, the mouse input will be very heavily impacted by FPS. So this is what we talk about in our benchmark of Black Ops 3. If your FPS is ever below 60, there will actually be, even in the 50s, a pretty noticeable hit to the consistency of the mousing speed. And in this way, it is worth dialing down settings even if you're at 50, just to try and hit a constant 60 FPS or better. And consistency is important, so the max frames per second counter is there actually for a functional purpose in this case. It is not a bad idea to cap your frame rate if you can hit the higher frame rates uh, because your mouse input will be more predictable. But you generally want to disable the sync every frame option, which is V-Sync, so get rid of that and then you can play with the other options like the max frames per second and see what feels best to you as a user. But if you're exceeding 60, if you're exceeding 100 frames per second, you really should not be noticing any mouse acceleration or smoothing at all because we're certainly not on any of the video cards we've tested in those scenarios. The only time we've seen it is when the control options are set to enable the filtration and smoothing and acceleration aspects of mouse input. Uh, so do keep that in mind. If you are below 60 FPS, just get it higher and that should fix most of your problems almost immediately. And then whatever's left, go play with the sync every frame setting and the mouse control settings. And of course the max frames per second one as well. You'll ge generally just play around with capping it and uncapping it and see if you prefer one of those types of input. So those are the items to change in the settings of Black Ops 3 if you are unhappy with your current mouse input response. As always, if you like this type of coverage, please check the Patreon link in the post roll video. Big thanks to all of you who have supported us through Patreon. And check the link in the description below for articles. Check the channel for other Black Ops videos. And I will see you all next time.